Good Saturday. Meteorologist Dean Davidson from the Weather Pros, liveweatherblogs.com. Taking a look at the weather, uh, weather update for the East Coast and the United States here. Not much going on. High pressure is locked into place here across the Mid-Atlantic, which is allowing you to get some warm temperatures. 80 degrees currently in Roanoke. It's going to be in the 80s, low 80s in Roanoke in Washington, D.C. Out in the 50s up there in the Poconos, our uh, meteorologist Jarrett, Jarrett Moore was telling me that a few minutes ago. Not much change coming, but we'll, we'll show you what's going on. You can see the high pressure will continue to lock in. We get a little bit of uh, low pressure across the northern areas. You may see a few uh, showers here as we head into the day uh, on Sunday and the Monday across New Jersey and Pennsylvania as a front pushes through, but that'll just lock down for Halloween to be a, a high pressure system building back in, making temperatures once again pretty nice, other than the six, upper 60s to mid 70s, depending on where you are across the East Coast um, from Virginia North. As you see, most of this is a zonal flow. It's staying to the north. You have these high pressure systems, even high pressure systems across the uh, mid Atlantic states. It's just going to generate uh, these storms to stay to the north a little bit, a couple of hours every few days with the front passage here in the northeast. A little bit of pattern change tries to occur when we get a low pressure system trying to develop over Texas. We'll see how that acts as it moves on. But unfortunately, I think this high pressure in the east is actually going to keep it in pretty good line um, and not allow this to continue to move north and push, push the, the rain out. Taking a look over the next week, 14 days, time predicts the pattern. There's not an area really in the uh, United States that's been recorded only have Warmer than normal here in the upper Midwest and uh, well above, and then warmer than normal for most of this entire uh, Midwest. A little bit warmer than normal here in the east, and Alaska is warmer than normal. This is actually expected based on the pattern we're currently in. And obviously, the lack of rain you see below normal precipitation for the next week 14 above normal here in Texas. I think those low pressures try to develop, but they pretty much die out. So, uh, this is in the Pacific Northwest, actually, may be storm because most of it's going to ride the, ride the ridge, which is a pretty strong ridge at this current time. Beyond 14 days, we do see a wetter pattern, and poor pattern that will fall the East Coast, and a warmer, and generally below average precipitation in the Midwest. So things will shift when the storm shift to the East, when like the coastal waves really starting to develop. So that's just basically the trend after 14 days. So. For the next 8 to 10, definitely, we're looking at pretty dry weather here on the East Coast. There's two showers that pass in the Delaware Valley and north. Other than that, we'll keep you updated. Meteorologist Dean Davison, the weather pros. Have a great weekend.